simply learn your pace your place hello and welcome to the software estimation course offered by simply learn this introductory module provides an overview of the objectives course outline along with an introduction to the course in this age of commoditization of software development and maintenance services it is critical for organizations to provide an accurate estimate of cost schedule and effort for the proposal in many cases only the estimates can be a deciding factor for the bid win lose decision let us begin by looking into the agenda of this module we will start this module with a brief description of this course followed by course outline which covers the various modules within this course the key objectives aimed at are covered before listing the value the participants derive out of this course this is followed by the basic structure of the tutorial and daywise agenda finally exam details and a few references are given for the participants per usual let us look at the course description in the next slide the software estimation course offered by simply learn is a program that has been conceptualized and developed for software professionals who are new to the field of software estimation the course comprises of various software estimation techniques that would help a manager to choose and use an appropriate method this plethora of techniques would help the software professional to estimate the cost effort and schedule for any type of project we will cover the course outline in the next slide this course consists of seven modules we will start the course with an introduction to software estimation this will be followed with an introduction to ifpug fpa modules three four and five covers the components and counting rules of ifpug fpa in detail module six covers ifpug fpa estimation for enhancement project and detailed course on nesma technique for enhancement projects the last module covers use case point ucp technique simple medium complex smc technique and planning poker techniques used in agile projects the entire duration of the course is two days learning objectives are covered in the next slide one of the prime objectives of this course is to demystify the primary difference between software sizing and estimation next objective is to make sure that professionals can describe the need for effective sizing and effort estimation the course also focuses on listing various widely used techniques like ifbug fba nesma use case point smc and planning poker lastly the course focuses on identifying when to use each of these techniques we will understand the value of software estimation to professionals in the next slide it is a known fact that software application development and maintenance services are under serious competition these days software projects nowadays run on tight schedule and are always in a risk of overrunning the cost researchers have attributed poor estimates to be the prime cause for such failures thus it is important for software professionals to provide near accurate estimates for probability of higher project success in many cases the estimate becomes the deciding factor during bidding a good understanding of various types of software estimation techniques equips the software professional to be effective and provides robust estimates for the project more than anything estimation helps in assessing the level of risks the project is running on a detailed analysis of work under development and determining its size and estimated effort helps the project manager to have a clear confidence of the success of the project in the next slide we will learn about the tutorial as mentioned earlier this course consists of seven modules the seven modules are introduction to software estimation introduction to ifpug fpa ifpug fpa counting scope application boundary data functions and transaction functions ifpug fpa counting rules for data and transaction functions ifpug fpa complexity tables general system characteristics ifpug fpa for maintenance and nesma and use case point smc technique planning poker techniques 
At the end of each module, there is a quiz section to assess the participants' understanding of each module. Apart from this, there are three sets of tests towards the end of the course with 50 questions in each. Some important references used in this course are displayed on the slide. Participants can refer to these links for additional information. Wishing you all the luck for the course.